Just a Teacher's Pet by Mercer Mayer. Just a Teacher's Pet. A new student comes to our school. Our teacher goes to greet her. We sneak a peek. Here they come, I say. Quick, everyone, sit back down. We all say hi. Then she gives Miss Kitty an apple. That is weird. No one else does no one else does that. She sits in the front desk. Nobody wants to sit there. She raises her hand first. She passes out worksheets. She turns in her classwork first. The bell rings. Class is over. Time to go home. Vanilla stays. She cleans the blackboard. She's going to miss the bus. We go to the music. We wait for the bus. We get on the bus. The bus doesn't move. The bus waits for Vanilla. She was helping the teacher. She must be the teacher's pet. The bus takes us home. Tomorrow we have a class trip. We go to the museum. Brunella tells us where to stand. She reads our names. We have to say it here. What a teacher's pet. Manila watches us like a hawk. Don't touch that and watch, watch where you are going, she says. Time to go back to school. We all stand in line. Manila counts us one by one. Today, we go to the auditorium for a program. We are too noisy. The teacher's pet says, hush. Today ends early. We have a ball game with the older grade. They always beat us. But at least the teacher's pet can't tell us what to do. Don't forget to invite your new classmate to play, says Miss Kitty. Bases are loaded. It is Brunella's turn to bat. I close my eyes. Wow, Brunella hits a home run. We win the game by one run. She may be the teacher's pet, but we all want her on our team. The end.